Hi students! Today I'm going to teach you how to use this game board to help you review all of the concepts that we've learned so far in language arts. Let's get started. You're going to need two things today. One, the game board, which is a link that was provided to you. And two, you're going to need your game sheet, which is also provided in your daily playlist. So, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to open up your game board and you're going to select a game piece color that you want to play with. So, let's say you guys know me, I want to be purple. So, this is my game piece. And you are going to be making your way through the game board, reviewing narrative elements and also grammar today. And you're going to keep a record of what you're reviewing, what the answers are, and how you're making your way through the game board here on this game sheet. So. The first thing you do, you pick your color. The next thing you do is you roll the die. So to do that, you're gonna click on the little hand that says click to roll. It has sound effects to it. Okay, I got five. So I'm going to be able to move my piece five spaces if I answer the question correctly. So you're going to go between narrative elements and grammar. You're just gonna go back and forth. So let's say I'm gonna start with um, grammar. I'm gonna click on the card. What is a participle? So over here, I'm on my first roll, game square number. I'm attempting five, so I'm gonna put a five there. Question, I'm gonna record my question. What is a participle? And then I'm going to answer. So right here, I'm gonna put, I know a participle was a verb, but now it's functioning as an adjective, a descriptive word. So when I use a verb to describe a noun, it's a participle. So I'm going to type all of that up there. Then I'm going to check my answer. So for all of these, when you click the check, it says click to check answer, it will provide you the answer so you can see if you are correct or if you are wrong. So I'm going to click this. A word that was a verb but is now functioning as an adjective. When you use a verb to describe something, like the barking dog, it's a participle. So if I got that right, then I'm going to move my five spaces. If I got it wrong, then I'm going to have to wait for the next roll. So let's say I got it right, which I did. So I'm going to I'm gonna move my head over. <laughs> I'm going to move my space or my um, game piece to five. Then it's my partner's turn. So my partner is going to choose a color, let's say blue, and then perhaps they're doing narrative elements. In works of narrative, conflict is the challenge that main characters need to solve to achieve their goals. Traditionally, conflict is a ma major literary element of a narrative or dramatic structure that creates challenges in a story by adding uncertainty as to whether the goal will be achieved. Describe a conflict we read about in one of our texts this year and describe the outcome. So um, what you can do is you can go in and you can copy this and paste it here for the question so that you don't have to type out this whole thing. And then of course you'll be typing your own response here. So, um, two. So if I got that right, then um, I would record my answer here and then I would move two spaces. Ooh, look at this. This is a special character. If you land on one of these special character squares, there's a special uh, challenge question. So if you scroll down to the bottom, it says special squares, number one, right here, number one, knowledge is power, click on the I. In addition to answering your game card correctly, name one similarity between gerunds and participles and advance three more spaces. Ooh, nice. So I could say, oh, sometimes gerunds and participles both end in ing. So then I would be able to move three more spaces. One, two, three. And now me and my partner are tied. So what you're going to do, and you're going to record those special uh, square question and answers down here. So then what you're going to do is you're just going to make your way through the game board. Rolling, going between narrative element questions and grammar questions, checking your answers, recording your progress on the game sheet, and you're going to make your way all the way through the game board, doo, 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 all the way to the end. When you get to the end, if you're first, you are the winner.